Welcome everybody to Alone in the Dark again. Um, as you may know, Alone in the Dark is getting a remake. It's scheduled to come out in January, but I just found out there's actually a demo for the game, or kind of a prologue sort of thing. Um, so it's not like content of the actual game, it's just an introduction to the game and the story and all that. Um, where you play as Grace. I'm not I'm totally sure, like, the whole direction of the remake. I think they're staying true to the to the original story and all that. Um, but, like, I don't know. I, basically, I don't know who Grace is exactly, but maybe we'll figure that out um, in this playthrough here. But anyways, it's a game I'm really excited for. Um, I played the original Alone in the Dark on the channel. I, it probably would have been a few months ago now. Really cool game to check out. Um, as it was like the first survival horror game that ever came out. So if you, if you haven't seen it, you know, I suggest you go check it out. Um, and this is a game I'm really excited for. And to top it all off, um, they got some real actors in here. Um, Edward Carnby is going to be played by uh, David Harbour, um, who played the role of like the sheriff in Stranger Things. And he has other roles too, and it's just a really cool actor. So it's going to be really cool to have him. Uh, in the game. I'm really excited for that. Anyways, let's let's get started here. I'm I'm just I'm excited. I'm all giddy. I'm I'm sorry. Did someone author this book already? Is this all foretold or Yeah, that's from Childhood Curiosity. You gotta go check it out. Oh, well, okay. Maybe it's not Curiosity. It seems to be more out of annoyance. Damn, graphics looking pretty good, though. This is all captured on PS5, so... Ow. Not my best work, if I'm being honest. Good, rich, southern accent there. I love it. Oh, first jump scare. First jump scare. All right, well, she wasn't very scared of it. I got scared when I started going backwards. I didn't know that's how those things work. Okay, that doll, though, that is scary as hell. That. Why is it so big? You sleep with that thing? Why? I mean, your bed? Your bed's looking a little bit dirty, too. Okay. Well, she's probably comfortable with creepy things, then. I'm guessing. Anyways. Who we'll let the crow in here? All right, it's probably explained by wind currents why that closed, but huh? Ah, uh, wait, wait, hang on. <laughs> Hold up. I already washed my hands today. Today? What? What do you mean? You already washed your hands today. I mean, maybe maybe times are different right now. Should be more careful with her medicine. But like, you just uh, you do it once a day and you're good, sort of situation. All right, what, what, whatever, whatever, man. I'm just uh, I'm just a hygienic freak, I guess. This mess. It's like there's like one book on that couch. Oh, we need a key for that? Alright then, well I saw... Is there a run button or something? No. Oh. That door over here. Oh, oh hey. Goodness, you scared me. What are you up to, You just to, forget Jerry? you have a kid, or...? I have to tell someone what is going on here. I have to try. You're not one of them, are you? Please tell me, Grace. You're not a spy, are you? Who spy? Them, the others, all of them. No, you're too innocent. I'm too innocent. The hell? 
I need to get this letter to my niece. She would understand. Just give it to the clerk, Mr. Waits, and he'll post it. No, he could be in on it. What if he won't Man, post this my dude letter? has lost his marbles. Then don't make what it happened right? to this it's dude? One of yours. Here, let me do it. Oh, yeah, that's actually pretty smart. Good job, Grace. I thought I was going to have him deliver this thing. Miss Emily Hartwood, Dauphin Street, New Orleans. Damn, you know how to you don't address an envelope? Not sure the postman's going to find it without... At your age? Oh. Jeremy? Where'd he go? I'm going to assume I'm he's the, bo myself, the door. <laughs> Damn. I'll just take this letter downstairs to the clerk's office myself. I barely know how to write shit on an envelope. Stairhall key. It's just one of those things that it doesn't happen much anymore, but like sometimes you need to do it because there's some like sometimes like I don't know, like uh -oh, government Sandra, stuff will need it mailed I'm in or something. And it's like, oh shit. Do I even have stamps? What the hell is a stamp? The hell? Okay, um, anyways. I wish Batiste would drive me around all day. Maybe if I broke my leg. Oh, you're really trying to take advantage of the system, huh? Um. Really weird. It's really weird she didn't comment on, like. Well, she did. She was like, huh? But, like. It looked like outside, and then it. It wasn't. It wasn't outside? Whoa. Oh, what? They're what? so creepy. Okay, so you are creeped out by stuff. They, this is really bizarre sculpture work. What? Um what have you done? I what why why do you think he caused this? I'm just gonna get the hell out of here if you don't mind. Oh shit, I can't. Okay, well, walking by all the creepy figures. Oh, please. Don't be following me. Thank you. I hear creaking. Okay, I don't think they are. Jeez, what the? Hello? What kind of monster was that? Can Does that mean not go in here? Okay, it won't let me go in here. Did something happen up here? Oh. All right, the, the bear isn't going to spook me, right? He's cool? Oh. Whoa, hold up. Hold up, you need me to press faster? No, they couldn't. I mean, I... I I pride myself on, you know, being able to mash buttons a little bit on account of my Resident Evil heritage, but holy shit, I think I think it just gradually fills up. If not, that's kind of insane. Ooh, we're good, we're good, we're good. Come on. Yeah, we should just get out of here, maybe. Oh, we should definitely get out of here. Oh, the door will hold them. I'm sure we're good. So, we got some sort of living area here. Okay, maybe the door won't hold them. All right, maybe that's a sign to keep going, but... I suppose this mess pales in comparison to the foyer. Hello? Oh, a little night music. Damn. I like that music. Little little LA Noir in here? Mr. Waits. Hello? Oh. <sighs> um Wait, so both these are locked? Oh, what the fuck? I didn't even see an, a window. I must have been totally blind. Ah. Uh, 
I don't like the pitch blackness. Oh. What in the hell was that? What are the monsters in this one? What the fuck? They're not your typical, like, zombies that we had in the original. Last night I dreamt that my uncle hung himself in the attic. That That's a rough way to start off this, uh... Oh, Joey Comer! Different, but it was still called Dorsetta. David Harper! It's a weird place. Feels like I've been here before, I just can't think why. Let's not waste any time, detective. Yeah, me right. Let's go get your uncle, Miss Hartwood. And that's how I'm assuming the main game will start. Okay, that was a pretty short demo. That was like a that was like a teaser. That's so cool though. And yeah, with with having these actors, I think they really want to focus on just having alive characters and all that. So, um, you know that. That tells me they at least care about some parts of the game, um, which hopefully means they care about the whole game. And I'm hoping this will be a good one because I, you know, I don't know when that was. If it was, I can't remember when I played Alone in the Dark. But anyways, that was my first time playing it, and I, I really enjoyed the game. So it'll be fun to see a remake, and um, I'm really hoping it's a good one. But yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't know what direction it's really gonna go. The monsters are already quite different. I mean, I mean, we had, we had some weird ones. They were mostly like supernatural sort of things, though, right? Like, I'm trying to remember. Like, there was definitely zombies, the weird like dog things, <laughs> and all that. Um, then they had things like kind of like the purple, purple ghost thing, and um, all that. But it's it's really weird to see creepy monsters like that. I should I should rephrase that. My tone was a little bit confusing. I'm not super worried that there's like monsters in it it's just it's it's different and you know it's it's always i think it's natural to be nervous when you like a game and it gets remade and there's different things um but regardless i'm i'm excited to play this um i might be playing it on release no promises i you know it depends on what the budget is looking like and all that you know it's hard for me to drop um well i think I think this game is actually fifty-four dollars. I think they have a ten percent off reorder thing, but it's just hard for me to drop money on a on a new game. But it, it might be happening. So just a heads up. I just wanted to play this, show you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed that little teaser. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.